And that's when I got angry that I was kind of thinking I might not be able to finish this. This is starting to get really painful, really painful. The hardest bit of the race was the fourth quarter, which I thought was going to be a kind of cruise into the finish. It was absolute agony. It feels so much longer on the way back. It's starting to really hurt. Seems like we've been here before. I'm going to go for it. Remember this? In the mountains, it was Murray who was in the lead until he ran out of steam. I've hit a wall. I've hit a seriously big wall. Allowing Ed through to take his first victory. Go on, buddy. Now, the positions are reversed. If Ed can hang on, he'll become the first athlete in last man standing history to win two competitions in a row. But this time, he's the one who's completely exhausted. Never really in any competitions have I given so much, I think, physically. I was running on empty. I was running on fumes. It's come down to a final chase across the lake. And Murray's giving it one last big push. That took every piece of strength in my body, in my mind. Agony doesn't describe what my back's in. Oh, I can't breathe. Uh -oh. In the village, word goes round that the first athlete is approaching the finish line. It's Ed. has to settle for second. I'm thrilled to bit. It feels so good. Nothing left in the tank. <laughs> Becoming the only athlete ever to win two events in a row, Ed is the last man standing.